Oh, Wolvi, time to wake up. Rise and shine, Stubby. Wake up. Up and at him. Fine, then. That's for all the clown jokes. That's for never calling just to say hi. That's because I get aroused when I slap people. <laughs> That's for all the furry midgets in the world. That's because I feel like it. What? Whoa! You! Wait! Up! Wake up! That's because the player keeps mashing the button. That's because I like slapping fleshy things with this hand. That's for being in more comics than me. That's for making me love you. That's for making me hate you. That's for never taking us to the prom. <laughs> That's for always working late. That's for being short. That's for stabbing me in the heart. Literally. That's for never letting me fly the Blackbird except when I crashed it. That's for being the worst wingman in bromance history. That's because I want to see if the player will keep doing this. That's for all the hot gamer girls out there. Hey, call me. That's for being a total douche. That's for never washing the dishes. That's for last year's white elephant gift. Who wants a white elephant? And finally, that's because the whole setup just added five minutes of bonus play to the most awesome game ever devised by mutant or man. I guess he's not waking up. Curious. Looks like we're flying solo, boys. It's as if the next section was designed with that in mind. Wolverine! My healing factor came from his DNA. So we're like twins, except he's short and furry, and he smells funny. He loves it when people ask him if they can fly the Blackbird. He's got these awesome adamantium claws that cut through anything, including my body when I piss him off. Screw the X-Men! Wow, is that a sentinel? Sure is. Impressive, right? You can see how they could destroy this entire island, populated with powerful mutants. Here come Sinister's lackeys. I guess they saw our Blackbird's, uh, landing. Wasn't exactly so. Let's get it on! Hey. <laughs> the hell was that? <laughs> Seriously, what is that shaking? Watch behind you! You want the mustard with that? my camera player thing was expensive now get up oh, oh shit that guy is big <laughs> dude is your primary means of transportation belly flops that can't be efficient tubbo here can take a metric ton of punishment hey player you buy anything that might hit harder? Wrong 
time to get tough, tons of fun. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Slide. Should have used the bye bye. Give up, Deadpool. Anyway, the island of Genosha. I'm pretty sure it's some kind of timeshare for mutants. Or the site of one of the worst mutant massacres in history. Yeah, no, I'm sticking with timeshare. Like we rolled a random look, more people that want us dead. Ooh, it gains? That means we're headed in the right direction.
What are you doing here? We haven't seen him since our run in the comics together. Oh, I love reunions. Wade, I need you to listen closely. I've time traveled from the future to bring you a dire warning about- Oh God, here he goes again. He's not here 10 seconds before he starts boring us with his dire warning from the future crap. Sinister has knocked out the X-Men by broadcast- We may want to pay attention. This could explain a critical plot point. The survival of Earth entirely depends on... Which all hinges on you, Wade. Now here's the critical part. It's so boring! <laughs> Make it stop! Damn it, Wade! Oh, man, did that hurt. So, we give Cable the slip? Looks like he left a note. What does it say? Idiot, meet me at the north end of the city. What? Who the hell is Cable to give us orders in our game? P.S. If you don't arrive within one hour, you'll miss the incredibly large-breasted naked woman who claims to be your biggest fan? Oh, don't fall for that one again. But, but, but what if Cable means it this time? We can't take that chance. Large-breasted naked fan lady, we're on our way! be into a dude who's horribly disfigured. They're related? Could be clones. Or brothers? They're gonna be shy of you place settings next Christmas.
Hey, try harder. infested with bad guys. Good point. Let's make our way up.
these? These are bullets. I need these. For my first date with a fangirl, should we do Italian or Mexican? Mexican. Duh. Good call. Never speak of this. For my first date with a fangirl, should we do Italian or Mexican? Mexican. Duh. Good call. I know, I can't believe you're about to fight me either. No arms has a gun. Is he armed? <laughs>
lot of guts. Bullets! How convenient. Ah. This looks important. You're making me look ridiculous. You're gonna make a joke about us putting our thing in that thing? Nah, it's too easy. What's the sound of one robotic arm clapping? Dubstep? That hole is prime jumping material. I think they call that a glory hole. Must be getting closer to Fangirl. You smell the perfume too? I thought she would smell better, to be honest. Think we're dressed well enough to meet our number one fangirl? Skin tight bodysuit? Check. Oh! 
Behold, number one fangirl is hot! <laughs> <laughs> I'd ask what that was about, but I don't want to know. Time is short. We need to get you to Magneto's old citadel across the island. Stupid fantasy! Don't worry, we'll land a real girl someday. This is our game after all. Wade, are you listening? Don't even bother with that security tower. Sinister is up there, broadcasting his... Whoa, 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 hold up. Mr. Sinister is up there? As in the S-hole who killed that other A-hole who was my contract? One side, Summers. I got me some business to finish. Damn it, Wade, stop! We don't have time to mess with the security towers. 